Well, middle schoolers at Forest View Elementary in Baxter are creating change in the world one water jug at a time. This week's Golden Apple, Sarah Winkleman, takes us to the Water for Life event. Nearly 300 middle school students hit the track and walked for three miles while holding just a little extra weight. To represent what kids in Nicaragua have to do every day just to get their water. With a special recognition for International Women's Day. Water carriers of the world are mainly female, starting as little girls. Who walk an average of three miles just to get water. It's heavy, really heavy. Today's students are walking with two gallons, although in other countries they walk with as much as 40 to 60 pounds of water. As part of H2O for Life, the students have been fundraising to help get clean drinking water to students in Nicaragua. It's really important that we teach our young people to become global citizens and aware of the issues that we face as a planet. These students from central Minnesota had an eye-opening experience when learning about the clean water crisis. Well, it's been pretty cool because you kind of realize how fortunate you really are in an effort to help others their own age. You're helping a lot more than just one school because they can help others once they've gotten built up. And after learning the facts, today was all about the students putting their words into action. This is a celebration of about two weeks of learning about the clean water crisis and about the lack of access to clean water. All of the water used today will be recycled into the floor scrubbers over the next couple of months. Reporting in Baxter, Sarah Winkleman, Lakeland News. Forest View Elementary has now helped 40 different schools in Nicaragua. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.